Well, if I win, we should take all the money and we should open up our own business. Something like a, a car wash or a diner. Something that, that you can be a big part of, too. Really? I was kind of counting on going back into the perfume business someday. No, nah, that's not for me. I know, it's for me. Well, how can you do it if I don't want to do it? Well, I could do it with the money you owe me. Oh, wait a minute. We're together now. Why should I still owe you money? Because that was the deal. But we made love last night, didn't we? And that cost me $47,311? Kid, I had no idea you had the meter running. Let me explain something to you. I'm the man. I'll handle the money from now on, all right? But I don't need you to handle the money. Before I met you, I was a very successful businesswoman. Yeah, well, you're crazy if you think I'm going to go around with somebody who makes more money than I do. But that's ridiculous, kid. I mean, who thinks that way anymore? Everybody on my block. I mean, that's just the way it is between husbands and wives. What are you talking about? A wedding. Whose? Yours. What, are you asking me to get married? Yes. Why, are you pregnant? Oh, cut it out, Hillary. No jokes. Two people like each other, they should get married. Now, how do you feel about that? I don't know, kid. I mean, you're rushing me, you know? What's the matter? Aren't I good enough for you? Yeah, sure. Oh, you make me feel cheap. Cheap? Believe me, kid, you are not cheap. 